Hi guys, it's me, Rick Day with the Cowtown USA, southwest of St. Louis, Missouri, Cuba, Missouri, southwest of St. Louis, <laughs> southwest of St. Louis, Missouri, a little town called Cuba, right off Interstate 44. Hey, got a 2021, uh, what is this, a Montana high country? 335BH, four season living. Now, I'm a horse trader dealer, and I get campers traded in on them. This is what I've got. I'm going to walk you through this the best I can. Got a power on it here. Got an LED light strip underneath it. Outside speakers. They call this the basement. All the way across. You also have, a, an, have an inverter over here, so you can run some of your equipment with, as well with it. I mean, the, the camper's in really good shape. Got a great step. Great set of fold-up steps. Upgraded my camper to uh, to have these steps. They're about $500 a piece. This has got it. Power on and on your slide out. And that slide out is probably going to be around 10 feet. Here's another thing that I like. Now, I've been doing trailers overall for uh, 35, 40 years. This is how simple this works. Now, overall length on this trailer is 35 feet. Everybody comes in here wants a bigger trailer, but they don't want to pull a bigger trailer. I've never seen this done. Now you can pull a 40 footer in a 37 foot in a 37 foot length. That's a genius idea. People really, really like that. I bring you in. You got a set of bunk beds here, which is, which is really cool. But here's the thing, guys. You got a separate bathroom right here. Porcelain stool, vanity in their own separate sink. That way, when you're camping <clears throat> and the kids uh, are running in and out, they don't have to run through the entire camper to get this done. Really simple. Now, there's a set of uh, closets right here. Okay, these are all foldable. Same way here. Again, all foldable. All right, we're going to walk in here. Now, you've got bunk beds here. You've got a set of beds up here as well. Pull this out, slide that out. And then you go up this like a gray squirrel. All right, you've got a bat mattress pad up here. And then privacy curtains. So, you got somebody else that wants to sleep up here, you can do that. I mean, they have utilized every piece of this. If you don't want to sleep up there, it would be a good place for storage. Flat screen TV. And I don't know if we're wired here or not. We are. Now, the big deal with the fireplace, guys, if you pull in these places, they charge you so much per night to hook up. What you do is you turn off your gas furnace and you set your timer or your uh, thermostat on your fireplace and it and just save your gas for your stove or for your refrigerator. Great idea. Plus, it's really nice. Okay, what we got here? Deep storage. You see how deep that is, John? Pretty deep. Okay, we're going to come over here. More storage here. More storage here. Convection microwave. All right, then you're going to come here, flat flat top, it's recess, so you can use the whole cooktop. Set up here for an oven. All right, <clears throat> now I don't know my way around the kitchen very much. I'm not allowed there. Drawers. Storage all the way across. All right. <clears throat> now, what I know about countertops. I know solid countertops is where the expense comes in here. So you got solid countertops with this as well. Nice faucet. You have a fire, you can use it. Wish I could kick it on now. Anyway, come here, you got a stainless steel fridge and a freezer on the bottom. <clears throat> and it's cold, so it works. Now we're bringing this back to you. He's got a freezer here. 
All right, let's go through here. Nice pantry. More storage. <clears throat> More storage. Okay, you got a couch over here that makes it into a bed. You got a dinette, I should say, makes it into a bed. And then you got your theater seating over here. As far as the materials, the seating. I mean, the seats look like they're brand new. Yeah, I could get used to this. Still got the plastic on the bottom of them. That's how that's what kind of condition it's in. And then you're going to come through here. You got your, uh, what is that called, John? The vacuum system? Just a whole house vacuum, I guess. Central vac. Central vac, yeah, that makes sense. Now, here's something I like. Now, a lot of these have went to a big digital type screen. You got to do all kinds of numbers with it. This is simple. You want your first awning out, your slide out, second awning, slide in, slide in, slide in. It's simple to operate. I really, really like that. Okay, you got your remote switch here uh, for your, uh, was that your solar? It has heated holding tank system, which is a really huge benefit as well. And it's really simple to operate. I can't tell you how much I like that. I notice also we got a ceiling fan back here. And what we got here? Extra lighting. Trade ceiling. John, look at this detail here behind your head. Now, this camper is fully serviced, fully winterized. Okay, so we're going to walk up the steps. Now this is something you don't see very much, is a window over the fifth wheel. I really, really like that option. And then you got a piece of this solar flex here you put up there, or you've got, you've got your, uh, your screen here. Pull that down, block it all out if you want to do that. And what do we got over here? We got hanging closet and storage. Hanging closet storage. And okay, there's your there's your central vac, is what that called. Central vac underneath there. Feels like a nice mattress too. Okay. More storage. More storage. Okay. Step around that way, John. All right, now here's something. I really like this. The entry level from the bedroom to the bathroom, instead of having to go down the hall, if you're buck naked and you got company, you don't want to moon them, so you can come through here. Very simple. Or if your company wants to use your bathroom, it doesn't have to come through your bedroom. All right, what we got here? Okay. Nice uh, mirrored drugstore. Yeah, here more storage <clears throat> and more storage hanging closet and it's also set up over here guys for uh for your dish for your uh, washing machine and dryer setup okay another portion of stool behind the door and a power vent above that okay can you see the uh Nice radius shower here. See, I think that operates. Nice storage here. Skylight above your head. All right. We, uh, a nice handle here. Okay, let's go here. Oh. Never have enough countertop. Okay. Storage there, beds there, ladder there, soft shades. Okay. Theater seating. All right. 
right, let's see if we've got any other. See, you tell I don't know what I'm doing. I'm researching this. But I think that's about all I know about it. All right. If you need anything else, no, let's go outside and look around a little bit. <clears throat> 110 out here. So if you want to set out here with a box fan, TV out here, you can do that. Set under your awning. This is going to be, I'm thinking, for your propane. Yep, larger tanks too. <clears throat> Storage here in the front. Now, this has got your road armor. This is trail air, so you have a better suspension here. Pivoting head. So that's gonna that's gonna give you a better ride. Been upgraded to that. <clears throat> Here's something that works out real well, guys. Is your auto leveling levels your front and rear. I mean, this works really really well. Uh, weight on this trailer is about just a hair over twelve thousand pounds. More storage. Then you're gonna come here. Freeze guard. City water. Tank flush, big deal, guys. Big deal. Black and gray tanks here, and the way to winterize it here as well. Winterizing switch. Back side of your water heater. Here's your here's your another access for your gray tank. Reach on there for to drain it. Another extra large slide. A ladder here to get up on your roof so you can check to make sure it's ready to go. Oh, I don't know what else to tell you. I don't know what that is. 50 amp service. Yes, yeah, you are absolutely right. So this is, again, serviced, ready to go, clean. A uh, little over half price of a new one. It's a 21 model and more warranty as far as the appliances go. Uh, than what you'd spend the $70,000 on. So give us a call at Cowtown, 573-885-6300. 573-885-6300, Cowtown, USA, Cuba, Missouri. Thanks, guys. Got Skyler, Timber, and Brian. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Guys, I'm going to tell you, thank you. Uh, you guys could have went any place for horse trail. They're all, over. They're all over, but you chose Cowtown. Um, were you treated fair when you got here? Yes. Matthew was outstanding. Mm -hmm. Answered all of our questions, took care of everything. Good. Could you get you recommend us? Yes. Now, when you recommend me, I do a happy dance. <laughs> now, I have to concentrate on this because you dance, you're supposed to use both legs. See? <laughs> you do that, then you, then you have to work. you, you got to work that leg. <laughs> now, some people can do that. And moving both at once. I'm just not that way. <laughs> I know you bought the trailer, but the dancing lesson was free. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thank you very much. Thank I appreciate y'all.